Second Field State Finals took place across West Michigan today from Hausman Field to Comstock Park and everywhere in between. We'll start in Division I at East Kentwood High School. Boys discus throw, that's Portage Northern's Randy Price. He claimed the state title in the event with this toss of 173 feet. My oh my, Price is a state champion. 100 meter dash. Chance Myers of East Kentwood in the middle. He would race to a first place finish with a time of 10.53. That's .02 seconds short of the all time state record. The win marks back to back titles for Myers in the event. 1600 meter final, or the mile if you will. Cole Johnson on the left of your screen took off like a bullet shot out of a gun. His first lap only took 59 seconds. Second lap slightly slower, but still finished a half mile in two minutes, two seconds. Down the stretch, Cameron Cooper of Oak Park overtook the leader, but Cole Johnson would not be denied. He crosses the line in four minutes, 8.60 seconds. Cooper came in at 408.96, crazy. Four by 100 relay. The Rockford team consisting of Melvin Mosley, Noah Stallworth, and the third leg here of Josh Patterson taking the handoff. That's where the Rams turned on the Jets just before Nicholas Isley took them to the promised land. 41.20 seconds, Rockford 4x100 relay is state champs. On the girls' side in Division I, Landon Kemp of Greenville, a South Dakota commit, captured her second straight pole vault title with this clearing of 13 feet 3 inches. She also finished second in the long jump and fifth in the 100 high hurdles. Switching gears now, Division II out in Zeeland. Starting with the girls' high jump, Zeelandese Tsunomi Norin takes it by a landslide with a jump of 5 feet 8 inches. She also won two other events on the day. Girls' 1,600 meters, Holland Christian's Kayla Windemuller started out in the back of the last pack, but by the third lap, she was the clear front, front runner. Last lap, she had a gap between her and second place. That was quite large. Wendy Mueller takes a second straight crown in the event, 452-60. Boys discus in Division II. Cole Walter had a plethora of throwers carve their way to the state finals. It was Connor Covert using this toss of 180.1. What a bomb. That led Coldwater's crew to a state title in a no contest. 100-meter hurdles on the girls' side. South Christian's Mariel Brooksvort in the middle of your screen. Literal photo finish. She takes it by a nose in 14.82 seconds. Look at her cross that line. Then in the boys' 110-meter hurdles, Lake Odessa Lake with Noah Cotty right there taking on the 110-meter hurdles challenge. And he hurdled his way to a state championship. Strong start and even stronger finish for Cotty. 14.05 was his time. 